G'day. Use three pieces of seam opal from Lightning Ridge, Australia. Rules in millimetres. Material's been wetted. The white you're seeing there in some places, like there, is the reflection of the lights. First piece, piece of vertical opal. That would be the top or the bottom of the fault line. And then the opal's filled in across it like that so you're looking at a long skinny stone but things like this I think quite often what you can do is try and make a large size as the face and um, make it as a pendant with a, a lanyard or set it in silver with a black blue and grey showing on the, on the, in the face It's got a bit of colour in here with this. Just need to grind it around the edges and see what you end up with. A bit of colour here, a bit of colour there. Might end up with a larger stone. It's a bit hard to tell with the clay on it, but we keep tumbling it all because um, stones will start breaking or wearing away. Last but not least, a bit of colour there on the top. No, it's not very expensive for you to have a go at cutting some lightning ridge. I hope you've enjoyed. Cheers.